What's up, Spikes? <laughs> Welcome back to the world headquarters of the Spike Feeders. You're here with the Spikes. Um, today we're doing a lovely game of CDH, but first, I would like to thank our sponsor, GameGenic, who's provided us with these lovely mats, some lovely stuff behind us for set dressing, as well as paying for this electricity for these lights. <laughs> Very important. We need them to stay on so you can see us and our pretty faces. <laughs> um, well, I say we just get right into it with the CDH today. I'm going first. Uh, I'm playing Shalai and Halar creature-based combo. We have some Red Terror, some Heliod, some counter shenanigans, and uh, we're just going to try to turn dude sideways. Right on, my name's Alex, and today I'm playing Ob Nixless Cac... 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 Captive Kingpin. Say that five times fast, I won't. <laughs> anyway, it's a Rakdos deck that's all about getting Obnixilis on the field, dealing one damage to my opponents, and generating value by exiling cards off the top of my library. It's a fun little ditty that looks to win either through combat damage on a gigantic Obnixilis, or by using something like All Will Be One. That card's sweet. It is. <laughs> Hi, so I'm Aaron. I'm playing Atraxa Grand Unifier. It uh, tries to combo it in a variety of ways. The main line, I believe, is Food Chain. But there's still there's Wither Bloom Apprentice combo and traditional uh, blue black demonic consultation Thassa's Oracle combo. Uh, plus this place for kitten. A lot of different ways, a lot of different colors, trying to do a lot of different things. I mostly want to cast a Trax of Grand Unifier. It's quite the card. It's a seven mana good spell. It is. It's it great. Is. <laughs> uh, and I'm Jim. I'm playing Najila Tempo today. This is a little bit out of my wheelhouse. Uh, but the, as I was talking about with Aaron yesterday, uh, the floor on Najila is really high. Like Najila and 99 Mountains is very good. Uh, and then this builds on that by adding cards. That are non-mountains. <laughs> <laughs> non-mountains. Uh, so what it looks to do is land in early in Ajila and just swing in with, uh, with soldiers. And while people are distracted, I'm going for any number of combos. I can make um, you know, infinite combats with Derevi. There's uh, Thassa's Oracle in here. There, there's just like a whole bunch of stuff. It's a very tough deck to deal with. Right on, Jerry. Start us off. All right, draw. I'm going to play a Marsh Flats and instantly crack said Marsh Flats going to 39. I will get this plateau, and then I will tap the plateau for a white, and I will play out an Esper Sentinel. Ooh, yeah, that's a good one. I will pass the turn. Right on. Drop. I'll start with a Scalding Tarn that I will also immediately crack. We'll find a bad lands. We'll cast Mana Crypt. Are you going to pay the one off for the Esper Sentinel? I will not. Uh. Oh, I'll draw a card. We'll cast Jeweled Lotus. Okay. Black. Three red. Mm -hmm. Obnixilis, Captive Kingpin. Whoa. Yeah, that's a good one. Pass the turn. It's not a bad start. I'm going to play a Scrubland. My turn doesn't seem as good now. Okay. <laughs> that's, that's, that's all I got. <laughs> I'm going to tap. I'm going to add a black. I'm going to cast Dark Ritual. Being the one for that? I'm not playing the one, unfortunately. You can have your card, Jerry. Remember, remember this in the future. I'll use one of the black to cast Soul Ring. I have two black remaining. I will use the Soul Ring to cast an Arcane Signet. Still two black in my mana pool. Was this not a good hand? Um, I'm gonna add a green. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna play a Bloom Tender using a blue and a black. This is ridiculous. Maybe, everybody. maybe, maybe I'm, just, uh, no, I'm gonna cast a Deathrite Shaman and I'm gonna pass the turn. <laughs> Listen, it got a little better after we drew. I'm gonna pass the turn. I, I, I agree, Jim, like, don't get me wrong, this was really good, but holy crap. <laughs> I'm gonna play a land and pass. <laughs> Sounds great. <laughs> Called shot from Jim Draw. here. God, I hope I have a land I can play. <laughs> I'll play this Wooded Foothills, and I will crack it going to 39. Trigger. Right. So I'll put a counter on Obnixilis here, and exile Stitcher's Supplier. Mm -hmm. I'm still new to playing against this deck, and mm -hmm. it's like catching me off guard in some of these scenarios. I'm going to get this Badlands, and I'm going to pass the turn. Oh, nice Badlands. Very nice. close to Ancestral Recall. Untap, upkeep, draw, play a taiga. Aaron, I have, I have a question for you. Yeah. Are you going to cast your commander in your turn? I could do that. Okay. I'm going to tap a green for a Avacyn's Pilgrim and pass the turn. That I'm worried, I'm worried, yeah, I'm worried about the question now. Yeah. Am I going to get manatized in the outer space? Like, I'll <laughs> draw a card. One, off. two, three, four, five, six, seven. But if I have a mana, I can get around it. He can red blast you. I'll play Urza's Saga as my land for turn right. and put. The first counter on it. Tap one for end the festivities. <laughs> Consider the festivities ended. Pain one for that? Yes. Okay. I'll deal one damage to each opponent and each creature and planeswalker they control. Yeah. No longer casting my uh, commander there, Jerry. Don't worry about that. It's okay. One Obnixilis trigger. Ah, ah, ah. 
Go ahead and put one there. And exile a Faithless Looting. I'm really sorry, friends. I forgot to flip for Mana Crypt. Oh, game loss. Yeah, I'll be more careful. Spikes or damage? It's what's up, Spikes. Uh, no damage. He cheats and then he doesn't even take damage. I know, right? I'm the worst. <laughs> so lucky. I'm going to move to Declare Attacks, and I'm going to go ahead and assume Jim will be a problem at some point in Attack for six. Sure. Six or 32. Jeez. <laughs> With I six. Start, starts at four. Six Yeah, damage. that's a lot, I guess. Yeah, I got you. And uh, we'll move to my end step, leaving these exiled forever, and pass the turn. On tap. He just assumes that I'm going to be a problem. Draw a card. I mean, I've met you before. <laughs> Well, I want to remove Wooded Foothills from the graveyard to add a green off of my Deathrite Shaman to cast a Absence Pokemon. White, white, colorless, colorless. I'm going to cast Ranger Captain of Eos. Ooh. All good? Yep. Yep. I'm going to find a Delighted Halfling off my Ranger Captain of Eos. Maybe should have played it over my Absence Pokemon, but I think they'll have the same end result. Pass turn. Okay. Uh, one, one, one man word. Oh, wait, wait, no, I'll take it back, take it back. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'll draw a card. Mm. I'm going to play a Savannah. Mm -hmm. oh, I drew a City of Brass and it looks so bad right now. <laughs> oh, that's okay. Does it no, effort. it's not. I'm going to tap two. Mm -hmm. And cast a Dockside Extortionist. Make four treasures. Mm -hmm. And uh, I think I'm just going to pass the turn. All right. Yep. Untap upkeep, draw land. Tap two, play a Sylvan Library, pass the turn. Okie dokie. And untap upkeep. Spike is damage. What's up, Spikes? So no damage. Huh. And we'll draw. Mm -hmm. We'll take up Urza Saga to two. We'll pay one for Ragavan, Nimble Pilferer. Okay. Mm -hmm. And then we'll go ahead and activate Urza Saga for a 0-0 zero, zero colorless construct. Sure. And I'll get myself this 2-2 two, two construct. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and hit Jim again because oh. that's how commander damage works. Still six? Still six. I will take six, go to 26, <laughs> and uh, up to 12 ob damage. <laughs> Oof, I'm, I'm nervous about this. Hoop yeah. Lord, as they say. And pass turn. Untap. Upkeep. Draw. Add a green. I'm going to cast Lighted Halfling. And I might have looked for it last turn. Mm -hmm. I want to move to combat. Attack Alex. For three? For three. That seems reasonable. Now I'll pass. Okay. Untap. Draw a card. I'll play this Windswept Eve. Oop. And uh, this feels bad. I'm going to fetch. <laughs> Trigger. Yep. Counter. Exile sees Firebrand Archer. So I'm at 25, and I'm going to go find a land. I'm going to get this Tropical Island, mm -hmm. and I think I'm going to use my lands to cast Nayila. Uh-oh. Mm -hmm. The Blade Blossom. Yep. And uh, if that resolves, I'm going to pass. All right. Untap, upkeep. I have an effect in your upkeep. Oh. It's a good effect. Uh, black, colorless, colorless. Yep. I'm going to play an Orcish Bowmasters. Oh. oh. So well, that enters and deals one damage. So if this card is fine, it's yeah, going to enter. I'll, I'll pass priority on the cast. Mm -hmm. I'm going to enter. I'm going to shoot the Ragavan. Ooh. And I'm going to make a Orc army. Uh-huh. Mass one. Go ahead. Uh, I have an effect in your upkeep. Okay. I'm going to sack two treasures and cast an Orcish Bowmaster. <laughs> and, uh, no, that's good against my Bowmaster. ETB, I will pop your Orcish Bowmaster. Oh. And the mass one. Oh no! Do you have another work for me? <laughs> I don't. I only have the one. I, this is the one I prepared earlier. You sure? Well, you can just kill the orc army, then you get your own. <laughs> well, I'll, maybe I'll kill it once the uh, Sylvan Library drops. Oh, I, we both have the same plan. And Jerry, you don't look. You know, you look a little dejected. Over. <laughs> it's so funny. Uh, I'm going to amass one. Oh yeah, okay, yeah, that was pretty cool. And uh, please proceed. I'm going to elect to still use the Sylvan Library and draw Smart. three. Smart. Trigger, trigger. Oh, well, we're paying eight. Okay. Jerry pays eight. Goes to 30. 30. Okay, so my orc army, they trigger. They go on the stack. I got to choose some targets. Mm -hmm. I will pop your orc army and your Abyssin's Pilgrim. Beep. Boop. Steal that orc army. Oh, that's... Oh, I see. <laughs> <laughs> like, I'm so excited. The, that might be the baddest manners I've ever seen. <laughs> uh, don't mind if I do. You, got, you guys get over there with your... All right, I'm going to play Flooded Strand as land for turn. We're going to tap a green to play out a Findhorn Elves, leaving me with eight cards in my hand, and I will elect to pass the turn, moving to discard, and discard a Kiki Jiki Mirror Breaker to my graveyard. Okie dokie. Ooh, okay. I'll untap. Oh, I was actually supposed to amass three, not one. And I'll draw a card. Trigger. Uh, we'll take up Urza's Saga, so we'll have a 
trigger for searcher library for an artifact card with three mana. I'm going to go ahead and add one colorless to my mana pool. Mm -hmm. uh, and just for the sake of expediency, I will show this polluted delta and crack this polluted delta while I'm searching. Sure. Off of polluted delta, we'll have blood crypt enter untapped. And off of uh, Urza Saga, we'll find Mox Opal. I have you down to 33. That is correct. Still one colorless floating from Urza Saga. We're going to go ahead and tap for red to cast Firebrand Archer. I'm going to respond to the Firebrand Archer. I will sack one treasure for black to cast Demonic Consultation. Oh. <laughs> Interesting. Good. Yeah. Good, good. Okay, I will uh, name card. I'm naming Silence. And I'll remove the top six. Command Tower, Verdant Catacombs, Asper Sentinel, Mnemonic Betrayal, Miscast, oh. and Deathrite Shaman. Okay. Those are exiled. I will now reveal until I hit a silence. Tarnished Citadel, Polluted Delta, Simeon Spirit Guide, Boseju, Intuition, Taiga, Misty Rainforest, Deadly Brolic. I didn't know that that was in the deck. Brain Freeze, Flusterstorm, Bayou, Fierce Guardianship, Lotus Petal, Veil of Summer, Soul Ring, Savins, Elves of Deep Shadow, Scrubland, Underworld Breach, Mystic Remora, Noble Hierarch, Force of Will, Ranger Captain, Demonic Tutor, yeah. Eladomri's Call, Forbidden Orchard, Final Fortune, Elvish Spirit Guide, Vampiric Tutor, Worldly Tutor, Bloodstained Mire, Chrome Mox, Tundra, March of Swirling Mist, Birds, Mindbreak Trap, Ristic Study, Silence. These are exiled. Silence to hand. Still in response to the Firebrand Archer. I would like to have my priority back. Yep. With Firebrand Archer on the stack, I'll tap Mox Opal for Vampiric Tutor. Yeah, that's fine. I'll respond by casting Silence. That sounds reasonable. I'll go ahead and start resolving Vampiric Tutor. Uh, silence resolves? Yes. Yep. And we'll put this card on top, lose two life, go to 31. Okay. Now that I can no longer cast spells, I'll just set my hand over here and cry about it. Firebrand Archer resolves? Yep. Firebrand Archer resolves. Yep, you got it. All right, I'd like to move to combat. Yep. I will swing at Jim for seven. No blocks, go to 18. And 19 ob damage. From the top, bro. Yep. Pass turn. Untap. Draw. Blue, white, green, exile one of your fetch lands for black. I have one, so. Perfect. Marsh lights down. Uh, and tap four, such so as eight to cast Attracts of the Grand Unifier. What does that do? That so, has so much text on it. It does. I lose two life. It can't be countered because I'm casting with Delighted Halfling. Okay. So I go to 37 from the, from the tomb. 7-7, um, seven, seven, Flying, Vigilance, Death Touch, Lifelink. When it enters the battlefield, look, reveal the top 10 cards in my library. For each card type among them, uh, for each card type, you may put one of them from among them revealed into my hand, put the rest of my bottom library in a random order. Okay, sure. So, I assume this is good? I'm good with it. Yep. Ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. All lands. Whiff. Turns out there were no cards in the, in the top ten. Okay, so we have we have Misty, Wooded Foothills, Dothy, Pro, Felwar Stone, a lot of, a lot of lands. <laughs> what the heck? We did it, Chad. Okay, but I still get Dothy, Pro, Misstep, Felwar Stone, and a fetch land of my choosing. <laughs> you had like all of your fetch lands. Yeah. I still, it still draws me five cards. Yeah, I mean, it's not, not bad. Not bad. Yeah. For seven, I'll take it. Seven mana, seven, seven with four abilities that draws you five cards. That's right. Yeah. All right. I'm going to add these. So I'll add these to my hand. Sure. Sure, I'm going to pay two life and look at Jim's hand. Why don't you make an eye contact with Jim? I don't want to talk about it. <laughs> <laughs> okay, well, this is a combo, right? Like, how do I? It is. But you need to get it's five. Happening. Hmm? It's happening. Well, I mean,. <laughs> Might have an effect. Sure. <laughs> uh, okay. Does he like to revy or something? He might have to revy. All right. I look at Jim's hand. It was good. I will draw off my Gataxian Pro. A uh, trigger Orcish Bowmasters. No! <laughs> <laughs> I will pop the Firebrand Archer. And you get to amass another game. I will amass. All right. That is all I have. Okay. So I'm going to pass. Pass her in. I think I might have an effect on your upkeep. Untap. Upkeep. 
I don't have an effect. You're off. I'll play the City Brass. Nice. <sighs> it feels so bad. Okay, so we can't go for it because there's not enough open. I, because I made a mistake, I should have popped the Lanor Elves or the Finhorn Elves instead of the Firebrand Archer. But I hopefully can maybe not just die. I'm going to uh, tap three. Sure. And cast Eldritch Evolution, sacrificing my Dockside Extortionist. Seems reasonable. Mm -hmm. Pass on that. Uh, I have. I'm just going to crack my Flooded Strand in response and get a land at the same time. Sure. sure. That will also trigger. Trigger on Nixus. Yep. All be one. <laughs> <laughs> we have a new enemy. <laughs> well, I, I guess I can. I can sell. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, yeah. that's not too bad. Right. Okay. okay, let's search. Yep. I think your fetch line comes into play first. All right, we got a Savannah. Okay, I am getting Phantasmal Image. It's going to enter as a copy of Atraxa. Whew. That's not allowed. That's absolutely <laughs> allowed. Uh, yeah, we're in stay alive mode right now. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, top ten. Yeah, top ten. Let's see it. it feels One, worse being on this side of the table. Six, seven, eight, <laughs> nine, ten. Yeah, I forgot that Eldritch is uh, extra less, or uh, whatever it yeah. was. All lands. Okay, we got Gemstone Caverns, Neoform, Jeweled Lotus, Gitaxian Probe, Volcanic Island, oh. Exotic Orchard, Lotho, Gilded Drake, oh, Rite of Flame, and Thassa's Oracle. That's a lot of cards. So... I love, I love Lotho. Not with Obnix Illus in play. I guess we'll take the Gilded Drake. Mm -hmm. And these go where? A shot, random one water. Okay. okay, so I grabbed Gilded Drake, Jeweled Lotus, Neoform, and Exotic Orchard. I like a three mana draw four, get a seven seven with eight abilities. Yeah, I'm into it too. Seven mana for mine. Yeah. I'll cast this Jeweled Lotus and I will move to combat. Mm -hmm. Jerry. I wouldn't do that if I were you. I could give my creatures that touch. <laughs> I'm going to attack you uh, with Najila as well as. Wait, oh, write this Orc Army. The Orc Army. It's a four four. And Najila makes a warrior. That's also going to come at you, Jerry. All right. So what's my total here? I got uh, four plus four eight. equals eight. Yes. So I'm down to 21. And uh, I think I'm just going to pass. End of your turn. I'm going to do a green and a white, and I'm going to attempt to cast an Eldomri's Call. Sure. <sighs> Dial him up. Mm -hmm. I will get this Felidar Guardian. Nice. Oh. And put it into my hand. He's got a Kiki Jiki in his graveyard. Yeah. yeah. I don't know how much we care about that. I don't know how I much you care about currently cannot do anything about that. Same. I will then proceed to my turn. Oh, the Bowman. And mm -hmm. Sylvan Library. Are you doing it? Yeah, oh yeah, I do, yeah. Okay. We're putting two back. Okay. Okay. So we get the trigger. Uh, Bowmasters, two, two I'll pop your Finhorn Elves. Yeah. And I will smack Alex in the face. Seems reasonable, I'll go 30. Overgrown Tomb untapped. Go down to 19. Tap four. Play out Felidar Guardian. ETBs? Yep. Mm -hmm. I'm going to exile target. Boom. Oh, look what's back. I actually I forgot to amass. This is now a 6-6. Six, six. Oh, great. <laughs> I will then tap a white and play out a deafening silence. Oh. Okay. It's one spell. Uh, Each sorry. player can't cast more than one non-creature spell. I think I have an effect of that. You got it. A mental messed up. A uh, hard cast or? Uh, two life. You got it. 33? 33. 33. It's down. Uh, that's my turn. Go ahead. Untap. Upkeep. I move to draw. To, well, it's, I think I have to silence you in your. No, he's already moved to draw. I'm asking. I'm asking. <laughs> uh, I'm running my face. Uh, I'll keep. I'm going to sacrifice my ranger captain. Opponents cannot cast non creature spells this time. Ooh, the double silence. This the is so double rough. silence. That's so rough. Oh, sorry. Almost forgot to flip for mana crypt again. Ooh, oh, we damage. did it. We got the damage. 27. 27. Mobile. Cataract Parasite. Mm -hmm. Oh, we know that one's bad. Magda, Brazen Outlaw. Ooh. So many creatures. Okay. Mm -hmm. I'm just going to sit. Pass turn. Okay. Uh, go to my turn. Upkeep, draw, take a damage from Kedrick Parasite. You got it. 32, trigger. Woody Footy. Okay. okay. What am I doing to try to not die? I feel like I have a lot of guns pointed at me. Well, uh, you know what's in Jim's hand. Say, yeah, I'm, he I'm, has the Derevi. I'm not an instantaneous threat currently. No, but I feel like there's a, a, a turning point that's going to happen. I, don't mm. get me wrong, I, in another couple of turns, I could be an instant threat, but I am not currently. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Give me a couple turns and I could be an instant threat. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, Whereas we got Jim over here being all like, hey, look, I have Najila's stuff. Yeah, no, I definitely am 
a little worried about what's going on over there. Uh, I guess the first thing I'm going to do is pay two for Felwar Stone. Yep. I think I'm going to play a Misty Rainforest as well. I'm going to pay two for this Dothy Voidwalker. Nice. I got off of my Atraxa. Affects the Dothy. No, I'm good. Okay. So you have an untapped one. I, I can only attack Cherry. He's like attacking Cherry even good. Um, you gain life. I do. Do you think Alex is going to trade his odd Nixillus? I kind of do. But I'm also kind of, I guess I'm not okay seven being damage? dead. Uh, that's fair. Yeah, say so You know what? You can... F the Obnixus is kind of good for me because it pressures you. <laughs> yeah, I know. Right? You almost got me. <laughs> almost. You want to check and see if he's willing to trade his Phantasmal image? Yeah, I'm also, I think, I okay am 100% trading it. Really? Yeah. Yeah, 1,000%. Unless you recast the next turn. You know, that part I'm okay with. Wait, what am I at? No, I'm 1,000% not. You can take the damage if you want it. Not gonna block. Yeah. Yeah, I think I offer the block with Jim. I'll attack you for seven. I'll block. Yeah, that's fine. <laughs> <laughs> I'm still gonna put guy over here. I'm gonna gain, I, we both gonna gain seven. 39, oh yeah. 25. Go ahead. Okay, I'll untap. So I'm, just gonna, I'm currently on operation, cast it again. <laughs> <laughs> Draw card. For nine Trigger. Mana. Go 24. Yeah. Obnixilis. Exile. Sulfur Springs. Mm -hmm. Play an exotic orchard. Oh, images uh, under the Dothi, right? True, yeah. Images under the Dothi. Yeah, that's maybe good for my second attract line. I think we just got to see if Aaron's got it. Uh, I will tap a blue, a white, and a green and cast Derevi. Derevi's in. Derevi. 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 I will move to combat. I will declare attacks at Jerry for everything. Yes. Oh, sorry, not Derevi, yeah. but I make two warriors. Yeah. Two? Off the Nijila trigger. Yeah, oh, Jira right. And yeah, the yeah. warrior. Okay, um, so if you block one, it's still five, right? Yes. I guess I'll let you move to blocks first. I will block um, Najila. Okay. I guess I will sack my Misty now. Trigger, counter, ad nauseum. <laughs> Whoa. Oh, there's so many problems. <laughs> uh, you got to deal with the one on there the board. There are a lot of problems. You're going to die to the <laughs> one on the board. Oh, now, now are you afraid of something? You see, you've seen that pretty unafraid last time. I'm going to put Tropical Island in the play off of my Misty Rainforest. And how much am I doing this for? This is March of Swirling Mist. It's 100 Aaron gets me with this every time. This is like me with Elliot and Nellic Trickery is Aaron with March of Swirling Mists and, and just anything that I'm doing. It, it, is, it is always March of Swirling Mists. What do you think March of Swirling Mist does? I'm casting March of Swirling Mist. Yeah, it phases uh, stuff out. One, two, <laughs> yeah. for X is three. Okay. Yeah. Uh, yeah, it's for sure Derevi. <laughs> Maybe the Bowman? One, two, three, sure. Okay. These will phase out. And then damage? Uh, damage. Oh, well, blockers. So, so yeah. So They bounce. Yeah, they bounce. You'll take three. Yeah. 16. I think I've only marched this really missed Jim's permanence. <laughs> yeah, actually. It happens, like, a lot. It does. <laughs> I will take one off the City Brass Trigger Ob. Trigger Ob. Detutor. And I will cast Gilded Drake. No effects of that. We'll take off. Yeah, makes sense. Thank you. And then... You're not going to give him the Drake? <laughs> no. no. <laughs> I'm just going to take. No give. All right. Then that's going to be it for me. We'll put all my right. phased out permanence in a little stack here. Uh, cards in everybody's hands. Two. I've got five. All right. Untap. Upkeep. I'm going to elect not to use the Sylvan Library. Okay. So There's I no just... moments. Oh, I'm using the Sylvan Library! <laughs> the okay. one time. Cataract Parasite and three ob triggers. For I'm, I'm, doing, I'm doing it three times. Okay. Alright, okay. right. so I'm <laughs> putting them back. So I'm just doing the one. So then I'm taking three. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Go to yeah, 13. Yeah. This 13. is the Cataract 13. Parasite trigger. Yeah. And, and then the damage triggers ob. Yeah. Oh! Yeah, yeah. Three of these. Yeah. It's over there. Sorry, I was... Yeah. No, no worries. Mental misstep. Oh. Uh, Marsh Flats, and Man of Confluence. All right. Bunch of M's. I'm going to pitch Simeon Spirit Guide to add a red, tap four mana, including two white, and I'm going to attempt to cast Karmic Guide. Oh, we're dead. F6. I have a Deathrite Shaman that yep. I can activate. Oh, play. yeah, okay. So cast of Karmic Guide. Yeah. Alex is f 6 uh, Yeah, I'll pass. Oh, uh, I guess, sorry. I... Oh. You have to talk, sorry, you're talking to GG, right? Well, it hasn't resolved yet. Yeah. Oh, sorry, so, I'll pass on it resolving. Yeah, the okay, ETB, resolved. ETB. Yes. target, KG. I will eat it. Yep. To gain two. 38. All right. 
That's my, that's my turn. Yeah. I, I, okay. I understand. I'm, um, I'm reading. To... I haven't missed that this and this are also under this. Oh, yeah. The Simeon Spirit Guide is exiled. Yeah. Right? Oh, yeah. It's exiled. Okie dokie. We're going to untap on our upkeep. We're going to flip for Mana Crypt. Oof. Better Oof. lucky than good. Mm -hmm. We'll draw a card. All right. Well, Jim tried. Then I tried. I'm going to play Sulphur Springs. Well, I can still do that. Pay one red for Stragged Rich. Grab myself a treasure. Okay. Pay two for Goblin Engineer, and I'll choose not to search my library. Okay. Sorry, Stragged Rich is exiled under Dalty. Yeah. I'll move my end step. Okay. Fast turn. Go to my turn. Untap. Draw. Let's get the cast of Jewel Lotus. CDH, right? Nine, nine mana yeah. for Commander? Yeah, that's pretty CDH. I'll have to cast my Atraxa Grand Unifier. You that got has it. been counterable for the yeah, second I'll, time. I'll pass priority on yeah. it. Oh, I did there. I'm out of this game until my next turn. <laughs> Same. One, oh, two, sorry, three, you took one damage four, from Kedrick's Parasite. Seven, Ooh, yeah, triggers ten. and stuff. Yep, it I does do. trigger. Yeah, okay, I'll let that. Oh, I may have. I will not have. Oh! oh it's a may. That's hilarious. Something tells me he's going to do it on my turn. <laughs> I don't know what gives you that idea. <laughs> oh, well, speaking of uh, a lot of two-card combos, I have a lot of halves in this pile. Chain of Smog, Swords of Bosher, City of Brass, Archivist, Grand Tower, Demonic Consultation, Opposition Agent, What's up, Teeth? Eternal Scourge, Demonic Tutor. Whoa. <laughs> so I'm going to take Command Tower, Opposition Agent, Swords of Plowshares, Demonic Tutor. Okay, add those to my hand. Uh, play a Command Tower for the turn. Sacrifice Stothy. I'm going to choose the cast, become a copy of Gilded Drake. Um, Gilded Drake will take Najila. It's wild that you feel that way. <laughs> uh, yeah, you got a Najila. Great. I'm going to kill you with this Gilded Drake. I believe <coughs> I will pass. Okay, uh, I'm going to untap. I'll draw a card. Mm -hmm. I'll go ahead and deal one damage to you with Keteric Parasite. Yeah, you got it. <laughs> so 22. I'll play this Marsh Flats from mm -hmm. Exile. I actually forgot, these phase in. Yeah, you have those things again. Oh, there's Bowman again. Oh. Yeah, okay. I'm going to play this Jeweled Lotus. I'm going to cast a Lion's Eye Diamond. Oh, that's six mana right there. It is six mana. So we're only going to remove Najila and recast it. Yeah, not likely. Then I will move to combat. Mm -hmm. And I'm going to attack Aaron in the air for 15 with Trample. <laughs> and six on the ground. That's so much damage. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I think I'm just going to maybe roll the dice here and block Orc Army. Okay. Bold. bold. <laughs> yeah. yeah. So Orc Army down. Yeah. yeah. So I'm going to gain seven and then lose. Uh, and so I'm, going to, I'm going to go to 45 and then go to 30. Yep. With, uh, if you get hit by Ob, you're dead, you're yes. dead. Yes. Well, unless it's a 4-3. Well, what is it now? 15. It's a 15. I can take okay. 4 damage from it. Yeah. Uh, Which is its natural power. Yes. <laughs> you can take 5. Sorry, I can take 5. I, yeah. I can take 4. No. Nope. Yeah. 21 is the total. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, he's saying that if he takes 4, he'll go to 20 command Yes, damage. and I'll live. He can take 4. Oh, it's 16? 15. It's 15. So you can take 5 and still live. Oh, yeah, no, that yeah. is correct. Okay. Jerry, Ooh. final answer. Correct. Yep. I was supposed to say my math ain't that bad after all this day. Closest without going over. <laughs> what do we win? Uh, an iPad Pro. <gasps> Provided by Jim. <laughs> <laughs> Damn. <laughs> well, so much, so much for June's uh, ad money. Yeah. Okay. I'm going to tap three and cast Samut, Vizier of Noctamoon. Sure. Uh, this is a 2 3 first strike vigilance haste. And whenever a creature I control deals combat damage to a player, if that creature entered the battlefield this turn, I draw a card. And I will pass the turn, these two cards getting exiled forever. Do you have a Derevi trigger? I do have a Derevi trigger off of the AUB. Yeah, I'm not sure if that affects... No, it doesn't. Okay. I, I, I misplayed it because it wouldn't have made it. Yeah, yeah, it's okay. Good. And then I'll pass. All right, untap, upkeep, Sylvan Library. Echo first. <gasps> Echo down. Wow. I will elect to use the Sylvan Library. Okay. There's a Bowman to get and play again. Yep. All right. <laughs> no, that kills a Gila for free. I'm at 13. Keep one. Go to nine. Okay, so I've got two Orcish Bowmaster triggers. I've got two. I've got three Kedrick Parasite triggers, and I'll choose to have none of them deal damage. Okay. I'm going to target Aaron twice. Go to uh, 28. That will trigger Obnixilis twice. Yep. Yep. I'll add two counters to it and exile the top two cards. They are Pact of Negation. <gasps> And Swan Song. Ugh, that's not good. 
I knew I should have responded to that. I will play a Misty Rainforest, and then I will tap Savannah for a green and attempt to cast an Elasaurus Shepherd. You yep. got it. I will then tap a Overgrown Tomb and attempt to equip Taiga with Utopia Sprawl. You sure. Heard? That's the weirdest equipment I've ever seen, I tell you what. <laughs> then I will pass the turn. Tap. Upkeep. Mana Crypt. Spikes damage. Damage. 24. Yep. Draw a card. Pass turn. That turn. I'm going to cast Swords of Plashers targeting Ob. Okay. I will tap the Exotic Orchard for blue and attempt to Swan Song it. Want to add a blue? Cast a spell. Targeting Swan Song. Yeah, I think that's fine. Okay. So Dispel Resolves countering Swan Song. Yep. And I'll gain. And Swords of Plashers gains you a lot of life. Yeah. 17. I will gain 17 life. Okay, up next to us, uh, Alex. Do you yep. want to leave it in exile? Uh, no. Okay. No, 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 no. So you're putting it back to the command zone? Yep. Okay, I'm still on turn. Uh, I will pay two. Okay, I'll eat uh, Pluto Delta. And take two to 26 and cast Opposition Agent. In response to you yep. casting Opposition Agent, I'm going to crack Misty Rainforest. It's all good. Okay. Eight. To eight. I will get this forest off my Misty. Okay, priority on Opposition Agent. I guess it's me, right? I will attempt to pack it. Yeah, I will, f uh, I will pass priority on pack. Pass priority. Pass priority. Okay. Got it. Uh, okay. go to my turn. Yep. Draw. I'm gonna move to combat. I will attack Jim for seven. Right. <laughs> I have to deal with that commander You do. Now. You do have a Gilded Drake still. I do have a Gilded Drake. I think I'm just gonna let it happen. Sure. So I will take seven, going down to 32. And I go to 33? Okay. Um, so I now go up to 33. I will... I'm gonna cast a monitor. Uh... Yeah, I have no, no effects on Demonic Dude. None. Good. Okay, let's go looking. Okay, I'm gonna find uh, this card off of my Demonic Tutor. Demonic Tutor has resolved. I'm gonna play a Vernon Catacombs and crack it. 32. Yeah, I should've done this first, but. I'm gonna find a Bayou off Bayou. of my. Bayou. <laughs> Vernon Catacombs. Um, I'm gonna add four colorless to go to 30 even. And then add black, black, uh, spending five of it to cast ad nauseum, have a colorless floating. I got your floating over here, bud. I will pass Prax. prayer to an ad nauseum. You got it. Okay. No, you're good, man. I'm you go. Okay. Uh, three. <laughs> okay, so, so 27. I, 27. Yeah. Four. 26. Five, six. 24. Seven, eight. 22. 21. Nine. 20. 20. 20. Ooh, 16. <laughs> 15. 15. 14. 14. 14. Oh, 12. 10. 10. Okay, I'll stop there. Colorless floating. Colorless stuff. floating. Cast the lowest pedal. Still colorless, colorless floating. <laughs> um, You're still at 10. Still a 10. Blue, blue. Cast Thassa's Oracle. Uh, no. You're holding priority. Hold <laughs> no, I guess I'll, I'll pass priority and pass. <laughs> yep. Um, you use Colorless Have Floating and Black to cast Tainted Pact. Responding to the ETB. Responding to the ETB. Okay. I will pass priority on Tainted Pact. I will pass priority. Okay. I will name uh, Morgan Mosey. Good. Okay. Good. Yeah. good. Good that you got the Enraged in there. Yeah, it's very important. Say, is that one name important. a card? Oh, it isn't actually. I, I, that was you, can, you can name a card whenever you want. Yeah. <laughs> Silver Wolf's Rogue Lamel. Okay. Yeah, you um, got it. You got it. Yeah, you got it. You got it. I was saying, I got nothing. Wow, Whoa, that was a game. weirdly intense game. <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah. There was a lot of. Everyone tried to go for it at some point. Yeah. yeah right? I, I definitely screwed up if I would have realized that uh, Ranger Captain had silence built in there. I would not have put all the only one on top there. Right, yeah. That was a that was a real big misstep. Yeah, it sucked sitting there all game with this Derevi in my hand, knowing that I don't have an opportunity to yeah. like, go for it. 
I really love this Obnixilis deck, but it's, so it's super holy buckets. Does it need like some sort of? Oops, I got draked. You gotta play brand. Yeah, welcome to playing Magda. Yeah, I got. Yeah, I know. Yeah, <laughs> once you know what it's like now, dog. Yeah. <laughs> On the bright side, at least three of you didn't do it to me. Yeah, true. It was only one. Build. Well, it was two build to Drake that game, yeah. but not yeah. both on the. Yeah. I love this Atraxa deck. I like it. You know what? It felt good because even even though if I wasn't actively trying to win, it was keep refilling my hand that I can keep dealing with what was going on, yeah. and then it's recast it again. I have to say, it felt really good, fantastic. <laughs> <laughs> that feels incredible. Yeah, by the way. it let me like kind of one for one myself <laughs> to stop people from winning, but yeah. then still able to keep me in a, have enough cards to also let myself win. Yeah, yeah. just huge. Yeah, it seems to. Yeah. You kind of got stuck when I hard hit the end of festivities. Yeah, but I still got to try to win the game with the surprise. Uh, yeah. What was it? Uh, the Kiki Jiki Karma Guide. Oh, yeah, Karma Guide for the Kiki Jiki yeah. in the yard. Yeah. Well, I like I had cards to cast that game. I was like, oh, oh. Oh. Yeah. Jerry knows the party's not over when the cops are left. You know? <laughs> that's when the party that's when the real party starts because yeah, you yeah. just lose the losers who get caught. <laughs> Well, folks, this has been a great game. We've had a lot of fun today. Uh, if you want to check out some of the finest accessories in all of gaming, go find Ooh. Gamegenic products over at your LGS. Ooh. They've got everything from card games to board games to going around and playing whatever it is Aaron's doing yeah. on his mat over there. Uh, in the they meantime, shuffle so well. <laughs> if your LGS doesn't have Gamegenic products, ask them for Gamegenic products. They can almost certainly get them in stock for you. In the meantime, you should be seeing some names going past us over here. Those are our patrons that help keep the lights on around here. We want to say thank you so much to them and all of our patrons. If you want to join those folks, it's just one US dollar per month. And you can sign up at patreon.com slash the spike feeders. And if you do, I'll be very happy. In the meantime, I hope you have a wonderful day. That's how Jerry shuffles. <laughs> <laughs> you can, I can believe that.